Hello all and welcome back. Today we are going to design this beautiful infographic using PowerPoint. Let's get started. Let's first enable the guides and format the background with two-step linear gradient. Change the gradient direction and gradient stop colors with white and light gray colors. Next go to insert tab and draw top corner rounded rectangle. Rotate it by 90 degrees and make it no outline. Adjust its size and then duplicate it using Ctrl plus D. Flip it horizontally and align both the shapes as shown. Now format first rectangle shape with two-step linear gradient and adjust the angle. Change the stop colors using color palettes and eyedropper tool. Next format second rectangle with same linear gradient and change the stop colors with white and light gray colors. Adjust the gradient direction if required. Next go to insert tab and draw small triangle shape. Flip it vertically and union it with second rectangle shape as shown. Now let's zoom into first rectangle shape and draw rounded rectangle shape over it. Make it completely rounded and adjust its size. Format it with 3 step linear gradient and change right most stop color to darker shade. Adjust the angle until this gradient becomes vertical and change second gradient stop color to same darker shade. Next format its outline with two step linear gradient and change stop colors with lighter shades. Adjust the angle until lighter shade color comes towards right position as shown. Reduce the outline width to 0.5 units. Now let's create shadow effect at the back end by making use of ellipse shape. Format it with two step linear gradient, change one stop color to dark gray and adjust its direction. Now match other gradient stop color with background and make it no outline. Finally increase its soft edges value until you get desired shadow effect. Align this shape as per design requirement and send it to back. Next group all these shapes and duplicate it using Ctrl plus D. Flip it horizontally, align it to first group of shapes as shown and send it to back. Continue to duplicate this shape using Ctrl plus D and make them total of 5 sets.
Select all group of shapes holding down control key and align it centrally to slide. Next ungroup all shapes and subtract a rectangle shape to remove triangle projection from last shape. Let's quickly change gradient colors of all shapes using color palettes. Finally add all text fields and PNG icons onto our design. So here is the final preview. Hope you all liked it. Please don't forget to like, share and comment. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.